Welcome back to beautiful Miami Beach for the Miami Super Bowl Grand Prix. I'm Jim Hendrick along with Stan Lane. And Stan, here comes the second wave. Yeah, these are smaller boats, Jim. They will be catching some air. I'm already seeing some boats bouncing up like corks out there. These boats, some of them are small as 28 feet in length. So it's going to be wild and it's going to be woolly. Watch them, watch them. Now you look at to the right of the screen. Look at those boats come out of that water. They're bobbing like cork. Whoa, look at the hang time on that. Yes. Pepe, hang on. <laughs> That's the F-171, the Pantera boat. 28 feet in length. It's a 24 degree dead rise V-bottom boat, which is good for big water. But when you got a small boat like that lengthwise, man, they're going to take a pounding. Those throttle men have to be quick because when they get airborne, they got to come back to them throttles so they'll wind them up too tight and break them. You're exactly right, Jim. These smaller boats are special nuts today. <laughs> And it's just as rough in the north turn. Look, look at this boat. I can't believe these guys racing here today. I'm just glad that you and I are safely here on shore, man. I mean, this, <laughs> these guys are going to be sore for several weeks after this race. Oh, they definitely will. They just come right out. Looks like you lose them. And look at Pepe Nunes' boat. Just comes bobbing along. The little Pantera racing boat's doing a good job today. Very, very subtly built boat. Cool looking graphics, too. Pantera. Spanish for Panther, Jim. And that open cockpit, they feel it all. The wind, the water, the roughness. Here is the Fountain GMC F270. Lanes now, especially in, in this kind of water because the boats can get tossed back and forth sideways. We bump down now to the F1 category. That'd be Nunes and his son Joe in the F171. Open cockpit and they are getting a winner in Manufacturer's One Pantera Racing Team. You're winner in Factory One, and guys, I gotta tip my hat to you. This little Factory One boat with single engine was showing their transom to twin engine Factory Two boats all day long. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Bo ran great. We finished it Thursday night, put on seven foot seas, had it perfectly balanced, and ran wide open from the start to the finish. And uh give a lot of credit to my dad's driving ability, and I had the boat perfectly trimmed and balanced. So it ran great all day, and we're really happy. And it's gonna get only faster. So with a little bit more time, we'll get even faster with it. But not only that, you guys build these boats. Oh, yes, we do. You know, it's a pleasure doing it, especially when you run a family business. Uh, my wife and my two and my two kids, my son and my daughter, makes it all worthwhile. You know, it's a family-run operation. A family affair in Manufacturers 2. Next time, and uh, this race historically is rough as well. We'll be going to Point Pleasant, New Jersey. Classic, classic race site. And then from then on, it is down to Key West for the first of two races. The first race, a regular race. The next race, of course, in November, the World Championships.